handicap the action coming up as this will be a two-on-one affair. So basically what you're saying is that we're Making likely to witness a drubbing unlike any other here tonight. Okay, got it. Weighing in at 220 pounds, the king. The numbers game might be too much to overcome here, guys, as we're looking at two against one in this one. But there's a reason why matches like this aren't fought on paper, Michael. While it may look impossible, I assure you, odder things have happened. Ladies and gentlemen, our two-on-one handicap match is coming up next. Why do you sound so excited, Cole? You know it's matches like this that cause careers to end prematurely. And let me tell you, that is nothing to be excited about. This is it. Handicap action is underway. Guys, unless oh, there's some sort of minor miracle that takes place here, we're about to witness a complete massacre. Beautiful technique. Boom! <laughs> Harsh impact. Neck breaker. Oh, my goodness, this hurts. Oh, you gotta believe this one's over. Oof. Targeting the shoulder. He's got the shoulders down. And a kick out. Wow. Targeting the back. Very effective. Oh, look at this. Locked in. Submission move here. Oh, nasty impact. 
he's struggling a bit here. Guys, he's going to have to turn things around quickly if he wants to win this thing. Listen to this crowd. They can see this handicap match is starting to slip away from him here. He has to be disappointed in this performance. He really is so much better than what he's shown so far tonight. This might be it. Oh, my. When this guy's on, look out. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. We've seen handicap matches throughout. Now that got those shoulders on the mat. And a kick out. Not even close on that one. He's not giving up that easy. Oh, he turns it around. Boom, what impact. No matter what era of WWE history we look at, or if we're talking about present day, the handicap match can be dangerous for all competitors of all. And if you're a superstar who's outnumbered, you have to be extra careful about ending up on the losing end of things. A beating could stop and ever end depending on how the odds shake out. That's very true, Michael. With that being said, though, just because a superstar is on the side that has the numbers advantage, history's also shown us that it's important to stay focused on the mission at hand and take care of business rather than to get cocky because you have more people on your side of the ring. Got to get back in the ring. We might just have a count out on our hands, Cole. He wants no part of the outside. This could end strong. Oh, kick. My goodness. Game, set, match. This one is over. He might have it. I'm not sure how much he has left. He's starting to show signs. He's on a rampage now. Nobody controls the pace of a match. Jeez. Right like this guy. Vicious knee. He's starting to stagger a bit. Don't be surprised if he shrugs it off and comes back more motivated than ever. The important thing is that he doesn't overreact here. He's taken on a little bit of damage, but it's nothing he can't oh, overcome. Man. He looks for it once again. Such vicious strikes. But can he follow up here? Uh-oh. But he's got to capitalize now. <laughs> Bringing it back into the ring. Assault on the lower back. He's got him covered. You can't teach the type of tenacity we're witnessing here. Unreal. This is amazing. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Spear! Spear! Can he finish him off here? <laughs> Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. And stomping away in the corner. Just ruthless. Looking for the finish. Just a step quicker, it looks like. Whoa, down he goes. That was impressive, Cole. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. In 2017, the WWE Universe saw the immeasurable power of Braun Strowman unleashed in handicap matches. The monster among men annihilated teams of two, three, and four men and made it look so easy it was almost difficult to comprehend. On the February 6th episode of Monday Night Raw, the Leviathan Braun Strowman absolutely destroyed four local competitors and made it look like child's play. Corey, I remember when we called the action that night on Raw and Braun Strowman was simply unstoppable. The easiest way to put it is that Braun Strowman doesn't care if he's in the ring against local competitors or WWE superstars because Braun Strowman just wants to tear people apart. There aren't many individuals who are just as dominant in handicap matches as this. Nailed it! That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match. We've got a cover. He's making a statement here with this attack. Yes! Unreal performance! 
Some superstars doing what they do best. Here are the highlights. I remember this part very well. Who could forget this? And I always enjoy watching him perform. Here are your winners, Bruce the Dragon, Lee, Chuck, Norton, and... Ladies and gentlemen, that's a very big win here tonight. That's a big win right there. Anytime you can pin another WWE competitor's shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be proud. And I'll tell you, the roof nearly blew off this place.